He's a single father with three kids. He's lost his job, and earlier today, they were kicked out of their house. With nowhere else to go, this is their new home. It's hard. It's rough. It's unforgiving. Nobody's going to help you, really, except yourself. That's the only help that's really there for you. That's what I believe. The really shocking thing about Angelo's story is just how common it is. Accurate figures are difficult to come by, but it's thought as many as three and a half million Americans need shelter like this at some point in the year. And increasingly, it's families who are being made homeless. It doesn't get much harder than this. Robert and Victoria and their six children have been living in the motel for weeks. From dawn to dusk, it's a scene of well-oiled chaos in two cramped rooms. Robert lost his job this autumn, and like many others, the couple don't have the cash to pay the rent, let alone a mortgage. You know, we had a home, we had a yard for our kids to play in, we had two dogs, you know, two wonderful dogs that we don't have anymore. Um, 